Hey, what's going on guys? It's Strats here. Hope you're doing well. Hope you're having a good day as always. Thank you so much for joining me in another Pokemon Sword playthrough where, as you can see from the screen, we're going to jump straight on in. We have been doing some off-screen grinding, and I mean to the max grinding, right? So, end of last video, what I will do is just so I, I can... <coughs> Excuse me. So I can see where we were at. We'd defeated Gordy. Or Geordie, or whatever his name was. Um, our Pokemon have changed quite a bit. Obviously, as you can see, we don't have Eldegoss in our party anymore. That is the main thing. We have Zwaylus, or Zvilus, however you say that. We've got him in place of instead. Is that him? No, that's her instead. We've got her instead. Um, but basically, Corviknight at the end of the last video, was level 48, is now 65. Haunter was level 45, he's now 67. Toxtricity was 47, he's now 65. Cinderace was 47, he's now 65. Um, Gyarados, she was 43, she's now 63. And obviously Eldegoss was 46. But we have replaced Eldegoss because we were never using them. We just weren't using it. So basically... I've done a couple raids, and in the wild air while grinding, I thought, you know what, I'm actually going to do one. So I've done one. And, um, yeah, the I think I've done three or four in total, and Zwaylus was one of them. And I went, what on earth is that? I won that! As soon as I found out it was Dragon, I was like, oh my god, yes. Perfect timing. Um, so, plan of action for today is get to route 9 so back to sir chester where we were in the last video we need to go through there and get to spike myth and do the spike myth gym we're going to get the addition to the um bike as well which is going to help massively and then we may finish on a couple of raids again. who knows who on earth knows because i sure don't but the reason why i've done so much grinding is because i pretty much just want to go Let's get to Spike Muff. Let's get to Winden. Do the videos. So hopefully by well, hopefully a few more videos, and then that's technically the storyline done. And then Oh, it's not actually gonna show me. It's yeah, it's not actually gonna show me. But that's fine. That's fine. Because we now have the expansion pass for Pokemon Sword. I finally went and got it. So we've now got the Crown Pass and a Tundra Pass, which is obviously the Crown Tundra DLC and the Isle of Armor DLC. And the Pokemon there are ridiculous. Ridiculous. I think on one of them, possibly the Tundra, um, the very first... Like, you literally walk out of the train station and you literally met by a trainer. And I think he's like level 70 or something. It is ridiculous. Do I have a Pelipper yet? Ooh, a max potion. Nice. I think I unlock that from the stores if once we beat um once we beat Piers. <clears throat> Tailing has drizzle. Flying and water, I wanna say this Pokemon is. Yeah, we've got it, so we're basically just gonna rinse through. Hopefully anyway. Hopefully. We are still grinding. Um, obviously, the trainers we meet along the way, minus the one that we saw at the back there, I'll come back and fight them eventually. But, uh, yeah, we're going to hopefully just breeze through the next few gyms and um, then have to grind a little bit more when we get towards Leon. And then, obviously, there's the whole endgame stuff as well, whether we actually... Do do that on here. Do not have a Daramaka. I have no idea what it is. But I'm going to assume it's ice. And Tox probably isn't the best one to have out right now. We should probably be fire. Which we're going to be taking for Piers, by the way. Um, <laughs> We're getting piddly experience at this point. So I've shot myself in the foot a lot. Because these guys are so underleveled, and I've literally all I've been fighting. Did I say a blossom? 
I'm going to swap to Cinderace anyway, just because. Um, yeah, because obviously I've been fighting very strong looking, i.e. anything over level 50 that I can't catch. Um, any that are, like, pop up out the ground and they just walk about, any of those, because they're naturally higher level than the ones found in the grass anyway. Minus a bloody Galissapod. Really, really want a Galissapod. I would swap Galissapod out for Haunter straight away, if I could. I've come across three, I think, and all of, well, the first one or two were very strong looking, so I couldn't actually catch them even if I wanted to. And the last one I saw popped up in the grass in the wild area. And I don't like this camera. Ah, here we go. Here we go. And um, yeah, I could not catch it for the life of me. Ended up um, getting hit by hail and gone. Never to be seen again. But Team Yao. Um, head stopping people from heading out onto the water with a Dreadnought. He's ready to bite. And obviously the vet. Obviously we met before. This vet actually gave us the Rotom bike. And now he's giving us the upgrade so that we can ride on water. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hey, remember me? I gave you that bike. Do you think you could do me another favour? Teach these ruffians a lesson or two? I can indeed. It's our duty to protect Dreadnor. And that means you're going to need to give up on the gym challenge. You look like you need convincing. So how about a poke about? Yeah, sure, man. You'll send me back in, will you? I hope you put that Dreadnor out. Or have a Dreadnor out. Because I've got Tox up front. That's not... A water bike. <laughs> That's dark and normal, I believe. Hey, yeah, yeah. Well, level 65, verse 39. Let's see how this goes. Bye. <laughs> oh, dear. I need to actually make sure that my mic is actually recording. It is, by the looks of it, so that's good. Gyarados, level 64. Buffeted by the hail, that's fine. Pangoro, 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 Pangoro. Let's... Um, ba -ba 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 Put Gyarados out. Put Gyarados out. And yeah, we actually got Surf as a TR from a raid as well. From one of the raids that we done in the wild area. That was a big, big shock to me. Because I thought it would only be a move that was learnt. Because they don't have HMs and that in this anymore. I really thought it was going to be um, just a self-taught move. But no, actually in a TR from a raid. I was very, very pleased. Very, very pleased indeed. And I can't remember if we done it on camera or not. But we have given Gyarados Rocky Helmet as well, so any actual physical moves that enemies do to us, they're also going to take damage, because of my rocky helmet. And then, including the hail, Pangora, it's gone. Gone. Cinderace about to be level 66. <clears throat> oh, I want to go back to Spike, but I really do. We'll go then. I'm about to go that way. Travel with me. Ugh, he's going to ride the Dreadnought. Oh, no. Why would I want to do that? I've got an idea. We can get on Dreadnought first and ride it away. Get a move on, Dreadnought. See you later, Challenger. Ah, bait. It is definitely the Patrick Warburton cousin of Squirtle, and it seems you've come to my aid yet again. How's the cycling life been treating you? You having fun? Wouldn't it be great if you could ride your Rotom bike on the water, too? That's why I'm going to add these special parts, allowing it to travel along the water's surface. Just for... This opens up so much more of the wild area. So much more. And obviously, we can now get across this Route 9 as well. Um, so like I said, there is a trainer back up there that we need to get to. Um, zoom lens. If the holder moves after its target moves, its accuracy will be boosted. Okay, yeah, that's... At this point, we should be so much quicker than every other 
Um, got Tox out, hasn't it? But that's ground. That's ground, I think. I don't think Tox is going to be good against this. Um, yeah, we should be so much quipper than... Quipper? It's because I was reading grab locked. Um, quicker than any enemy that we face. I will, however, use another quick ball. Oh, as you can see there, quick ball is at 66. We started with 101, I believe, at the start of last video. That was just to put into perspective how much we've been grinding. Oh, no! Oh, excuse me. Excuse me, s'il te plaît. Je suis désolé. Um, yeah, I don't think that was probably a bad move to do, actually. The crit, which is awesome. Oh, I didn't get poisoned. Excellent. Excellent. I think it might be toxic, mightn't it? Um, what do we want for this one? Give it a luxury ball. Um, do, 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 do. We could always go with a netball if we have one. No, we don't. Um, so, yeah, so she's an ultra ball. Because, yeah, what I would really, really like... Oh, wow, okay. Jeez. Super power. Oh, that's all right. We can withstand a few of those. Um... Its defense keeps falling, so I cannot afford to hit it now because it will just... Especially with the hail as well, so we're just going to have to try and ball it. But, um, yeah, with, obviously, the DLC now coming into play, I really, really want to have at least a party of Pokemon that's 90 to 100. Cinderace, level 66. 66. Because that would be really, really, really good to have. A body is fighting type. That's what it was. A body made up of nothing but muscle makes the grappling moves this Pokemon performs something. Because it just went through. Okay. Bye bye. And it is level 50. So it's now 15 levels lower than us. Big Pearl. Finally, I can go and sell that at the street market, can't I? Pearl string. Very large pearls that sparkle in a pretty silver color. They could be sold at high price to shops. That's cool. Uh, this isn't a Wyomer, is it? Oh, it is a Wyomer. Oh, nice. Obviously, what I really want to do as well is try and shiny hunt. Now, that in itself is going to be a ball egg. Um, but it's going to be easy to do. Very, very easy to do in the sense of... I just need to find a spawn place for a couple of Pokemon, make sure that they do keep spawning, and we just keep battling. Battle, 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 battle. And then we'll be sorted. So it might be a case that I'll start off on like a Wulu or something and go right back to start game and keep doing that. But obviously it's not going to really be anything of all too great. Is that an Octorok? Not an Octorok. What is it in Pokemon? Piece of Never Melt Ice. It's a heat repelling piece of ice that boosts the power of ice type moves. And, ah, my ear. Ow. Ah, harsh ringing. Very, very bad ringing. <laughs> Ow. Clobopus. Was this a Clobopus? It was a Clobopus. Is this the one that evolves into Grappalocked? Whichever, whatever one we just caught was. So yeah, it is a lot planned, a lot, lot planned. So I'm kind of hoping we can just steamroll through at least this gym and Raihan, but I think there's a whole thing before Raihan. I know there's a whole thing at Winden. I know that much for sure. But um, Octillery, that was it. I'm thinking of Zelda and the Octoroks. It's not Octillery. <coughs> another quick ball. Because why not? So yeah, it's been a lot on my mind of what I want to do in here. 
And like I say, if I can have a party of 90 to 100, that would be fantastic. Because I know I'm never going to get all the Pokemon. I have installed Pokemon Home on mobile and on Switch. Obviously, I don't have online membership for Nintendo because it's only this game that I would have it for. And quite frankly... What's that? Quite frankly... I would probably use it once a month, if that. Probably once every couple of months. And at this point, it would only be to trade. <laughs> so, you know. There is... I'd, I'd like to do raids with people. That I would do. But I just can't justify. Can't justify another online membership for multiplayer purposes. But we'll see. We've got a bag, mate. We're catching loads at the minute. Absolute tons. We are now, I think, above the amount of Pokemon that I had on the first playthrough. I think. Our party is fairly different, actually, as well. Very fairly different. Um, is this the right way I need to go, or do I need to go back down this way? I don't know. don't know what that was. I'll take this, though. Mantine. I really want the shark really, really want a shark one. I think it looks so cool. I just don't know where it is nor what it's called. But, uh, yeah, hopefully we can do Spike with fairly easy. I'm going to put Cinderace up front because obviously a lot of them are like two factions, but one of them is guaranteed dark on all of them. And I think fighting is fairly good against it. Plus, if we do come up against one that we're like, ooh... Oh, nothing super effective. We've got fire. And with charcoal, the held item for Cinderace, obviously boosting fire type moves, it's just going to be so much, so much damage done. Don't go this way, don't go this way, don't go this way. <laughs> Search Esther Bay. Found a protector. A protective item of some sort. It's extremely stiff and heavy. It's loved by a certain Pokemon. Extremely stiff and heavy. So is that going to be a Gerda type Pokemon that's going to love it? I think there's some Remoraids over there. Um, why do I think that something is here? Why is that? Oh my Christ! Why is that there? Found a big pearl. That's cool. Ah, oh, Misty. Doing research to see if one day I can swim anywhere with my beloved Toxapex. Or Tokapex. Do I need to censor that? <laughs> Toxapex. Oh. Oh, is that... There's another Pokemon like that, isn't there? Um... Oh, what's it called? It's bright purple. I think. Oh, mate, what is the... Can it? Can it? I'm sure there's another Pokemon that looks like that. Sure there is. But Tox v Tox. So we shall... I think... Boom Burst is probably going to be the best one to use. Not because of type advantage, because it's normal. But because it's 140. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I think Zuelus is ready to evolve now, I think. Is this the limit of water types? No, I can still come up with more. So that was actually water, or something can water. Interesting. Could have just used overdrive and we'd have been fine. We'd have just absolutely knocked it out. But let's catch one and find out what it is. If I can actually hit it. Thank you. <coughs> Marini. That was it. Marini. Is that its pre-evolution then? I wonder. I wonder if it... I imagine it is, wouldn't it? Because it's very, very similar. It must be the pre-evolution. God. But we caught it. We caught it. Free XP for all. Uh, 
Uh, first symptom of its sting is numbness. The next is an itching sensation so intense that it's impossible to resist the urge to claw at your skin. Brutal star Pokemon. Poison them all. <sighs> did we get one of you? I think we did. It was just in our communication. Bit on the left. Oh my Christ. Jelly Sand. Looks like King Zora. Whoop. 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 Those of you that have played Ocarina of Time will know that reference. So it looks like we're going to fight it. It is water type, so we could just destroy it. But uh, I'm actually going to swap Pokemon because Tox is possibly about to die. And I don't want him to. I want him to keep getting XP. So we'll withdraw him for now, but Zwilus out. Which is going to be better to use, Crunch or Body Slam? We'll go with Crunch to try and do a little bit of damage. Hopefully it won't one hit. It won't hit. It won't hit. That's fine. We'll pick up another one, I'm sure. And then obviously we'll Quick Ball it and same, same. It'll be alright on the night. we crawl through here. Scope lens. It's a lens for scoping out weak points. It boosts the holder's critical hit ratios. That's a good one for um, Farfetch'd to get to evolve. I can't enter Spikemuth, so I've just been hanging around here this whole time. No one can challenge the dark type leader like this. What's with the gate being shut? How am I supposed to get the badge now? You get money to go around. Hey, Strads. Hi, Manny. Let me quickly grab this jellison and I'll be right with you. Be right with you, pal. Didn't heal up Tox. That I did not do, so he may pass out. He may pass out if we don't catch this on this throw. Oh. Way! There we go. <laughs> Most of this Pokemon's body composition is identical to seawater. It makes sunken ships its lair. I might as well have been playing a little bit of Sea of Thieves recently. Um, the thing is, I know there's... Is there a... What's that? Oh, that's one of those Pokemon we've already got down there. Um, I know there's a Poker Center in just inside. Um, just inside, what do you call it? Um, inside the st stadium. But, but, I need 164 HP on that, which I. Th I mean, that's only 120. That would then give 80 if we use that on top. We want. We got anything else? I can. Right, 10 points. Burn. Spec defense. Restores users HP, but causes confusion if it hates the taste. That's great. Uh, makes it more friendly, but lowers HP. That's awful. Uh, restores HP, but causes. Yep. 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 Uh, makes it more friendly below as its defense. Ugh, yeah, okay. Um, yeah, let's just use a hyper potion for now. And then a super. Didn't quite fill it, but that's absolutely fine. Oh, no, don't want to do that. I wanted to... I wanted to move my Pokemon a boot. Gonna do that and that. I can't remember if we need to fight Marnie here or not. Oh no, don't want Clobopus. We got one. We got one now. But it's fighting, isn't it? <coughs> so yeah, we're not. We're not even going to waste our time. Not as we're by the gym. We've been going for... 
over half an hour now. So we'll um, we'll do this, and then we'll we'll, we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. Um, you'll have to beat me in a battle first. But yeah, you have to beat her in a battle to gain access, which does suck. But you know, it, 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 it is it is good in the sense that it gives you more XP. It's free XP. And we are so overleveled. <laughs> they do not stand a chance. If they knock any one of my Pokemon out, I have failed massively. Massively. I've powered up a whole lot. I'm going to beat you lot into the ground. Got it? Alright then. Coffee's on me afterwards, yeah? Yeah, fighting is super effective, at least against Leopard. Does 22 damage with Sucker Punch. But one kick and it's gone. <laughs> oh. Like I said, the plan was to get this really over leveled so I could just breeze through the gyms. Because I really want to get down to the DLC. Toxicroak. Toxicroak. Is that going to be dark poison or is it going to be dark water? We'll keep Cinderace out for now. I think it's partially water, so Tox could have just overdrived and one hit it. I'm hoping Double Kick will do the same. No. <laughs> no, we have failed. Uh oh. He uses Poison Jab. Was it poison and water? Let Let's do this. I really want Haunter to blum and evolve. The only good thing is, is in the wild over there is a Gengar that walks around. The, the ones I've encountered were 52 and 54. So once we've got Spike with Jim, I can then just go and catch a Gengar. Then we'll be good. But I think I also need to actually um, catch a Ghastly. I think. Get the whole family tree. Doesn't say it was super effective though. Ooh, okay. They might be fight I really don't know. That to me looked like a frog. That to me says it should be water. Uh what Pokemon is she using? Scrafty. Scrafty. Evolution of Scraggy, I believe. Let's just use Boom Burst, because that's a powerful. Uh, not a lot of XP though. More Peko! Yeah, let's leave Toxin. Let's leave Toxin. As expected on arrival, you really know how to get me riled up. Saucy. <coughs> Did manage to catch up more Peko. I'm so happy. I think it was like level 40. It was either 40 or 50. So happy with it. So, so happy. Yeah, still no. Still no. That's okay, though. What's with that? My Pokemon didn't get a chance to really do their thing at all. Ugh. Ugh. Panama Pekka has been interesting you and your strength. I think I get it now. But I've got every... I mean, I've got everyone in Spike Man supporting me. It's definitely going to get all eight gym badges, just so I can have a rematch with you. Don't you forget it. I'll get my revenge in the Champion Cup. Anyway, I promised I'd show you a way in, so come on, follow me. I'm adding words into the grip there. Oopsie poopsie. Oopsie poopsie. Spike Man. The one gym that is a whole city. The one gym that cannot Dynamax. And there's a whole spiel that Piers does as well, telling you about it. And I will skip through his dialogue. For the time being. Because like I say, it is literally just all. Oh, here at the gym, yeah, we use these. We appreciate this. And we don't, we can't Dynamax and blah, blah, blah. Yes, I know. Rare Pokemon at Wedgehurst. Right, here to buy. I want to 
buy some more hyper potions. We'll take 18 more. This gives me up to 30. Uh, super potion actually got over 30. Uh, Multiple has got 58. Great balls, pokey balls. Um, I will sell the pearls that I found. Treasures. So we'll sell the. Ooh, he was offering 25 grand. So it is. Neither here nor there, really. And that will do nicely. That will do. Right, have we got Cinderace at front still? Do. Nice. Here's money. With the shutter closed, nobody's going to be able to turn into the gym. I've got to look into this. Just happen to have too many of these, so I'll give you one. Got it? You can handle yourself. So if you haven't guessed it already, Marnie is Piers' sister. Hold on, mate. If you're going to take the challenge, you better change into your uniform. Oh, I mean. oh hey, pal. Oh, hey, sunshine. You're looking for the leader. He's straight ahead from here. Along with Mr. Mimes and all sorts. Challenger, you want to get past me, but I don't want that. Basically, it's going to be a battle between our desires. Hey, no worries. I can take that. I like how the grunts don't actually even get assigned names. Like, there's no Carl, Torida, or Bill and Ben's none. Right, super kick. They should go down in one. It does. It does. Still. Hey. I thought I'd get a little bit more being a challenge, like an actual trainer, but. Oh. If we can get a hydrogen by the end of this gym, though, that would be awesome. That would be awesome. And we come through there. They come behind us. And I think we have to go through a house. Oh, she's a challenger made it through. All us Team Yell members are blocked away. Don't think you'll just walk right through. Well, I kind of will. I kind of will. It's evil. Did I? I think I caught a evil in the end. Um, doobly kick. Doobly, doobly, doobly kick. That'll do nicely. That'll do nicely. I think I need to get a new mic arm. Or just some WD-40. <laughs> Be damn sight cheaper. Damn sight cheaper. I wasn't able to properly greet you. No. But it's okay, I said hi. Oh dear, excuse me. Right, Mr. Mime's gonna then run off. Barry, Barry. Barry, Barry. And then which one? Oh yeah, they come out the windows, don't they? Breaks his legs. Did I surprise you? I'm a little surprised how much my legs hurt from that landing. <laughs> legs. I decided to jump out a window and I'm in pain. It's all your fault. Yeah, of course. Oh, of course. It's crafty. Double kick. This is going to be probably one of the most... One moved gyms I'll ever have. Because I only have one fighting move. Corvy, level 66. I mean, to be fair, for Pierce himself, I might end up going into like Pyro Ball and that just to do a lump sum of damage. But I think he's only like level 44 in that, so. 
Max Revive. This one is it. Where? HP of your Pokemon not looking so good. They're fine. A back handspring. And no, I wasn't really surprised. Was not really surprised. Weavile. Ooh, Sneasel. Sneasel evolution. Um, I think... I'm going to assume Double Kick is fine against a Weavile. Not entirely sure. Yeah. <laughs> it... <laughs> Okay, it was super effective. I was going to say, it didn't say it was super effective, but it was. It was. Tox almost level 66 as well. Probably one more battle and he'll be up. Seriously, you got to be kidding me. It's already over? Yeah. I'm just that quick. I shouldn't brag about that, really. That's something you don't want to brag about. <laughs> oh, dear. Go to Mr. Mime. Off your pop. Sign will light up, I think. No, it doesn't. Yeah. Takes the field. Is, is this one where... Yeah, he does come in on my path. Oh. Team Yo, you're boring me. You're boring me. Drapion. Ooh. Ooh. This is going to be a good test. So, is... Double Kick is not actually super effective against Drapion. That's fine. I shall have Pyro Ball against that. And I shall Flash Cannon against Leopard. Leopard. Yeah, fire moves are going to be fine against him. <laughs> Tox level up. This should one hit it. Nice. Or even you're in here, but... It, it would have been better if you'd just lost. Yeah, but I would have been here for hours. Haven't you try and knock out all six of my Pokemon? Gym leader's up next. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. That's good, because... It's time. Shut your gob. Oh, strats. Uh, I'm really sorry. The lot from Spike was telling me they locked down the city for my sake. Spike must just... Spike just keeps getting worse and worse, and all Piers says is, "Don't worry." So, 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 so we decided to disguise ourselves as Team Yell and sabotage the other challengers. We thought if we could stop the other challengers from reaching the gym, then Ms. Manu would be the only one to win and make it to the cup. And we figured that it increased the chance of my wonderful Ms. Manu becoming the new champion. Ah, <sighs> that's no way to help someone at all. Strads, no need to bother with all the preparations or whatever. Just. Go on, face the leader. What's over here then? Looking for a Pokemon trade. How about your Obstagoon for my Cantonian, Mr. Mime? Oh, don't have an Obstagoon yet. Yet, I will say. Like I said, I'm going to skip through a lot of this because this is just a bit about him singing and doing a concert and then obviously talking about how he can't Dynamax. So, I mean, it will still be on screen, but we'll just skip through the dialogue. So you're finally here, huh? So I'm really, not really a great leader, blah, 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 blah. That's why no one was coming. It's a bit of a downer. A bit of a downer. And, uh, yeah. I feel I do feel for him. Because all, all his little people there decided to shut the gym down. 
no one could then obviously come in. He thought because no one was coming to him that he wasn't a good leader. And because he can't Dynamax, he can't. He's also not a good leader. Is I feel for him. I do. I do. I really, really do. But it's not his fault. It's not his fault. It's the people around him. Everyone cheer on my Pokemon and let's do it. Scrafty intimidate the opponent. I would laugh if they forgot to actually give that his Scrafty the ability of intimidate. <laughs> I really would. Oh, lucky. Lucky hit. Lucky hit there with a the flinch. Are we going to get him to waste a, a full restore so early on? Yeah, no. I don't know, but I'm going to flame charge him. Because I want I want it to be something different. I want to actually use other moves than just super effective moves. Because like that, we, we can just knock him out easy. So. <laughs> <laughs> Zuelus hopefully will up uh, will um Alamar Alamar that's a psychic one right? What are the Pokemon could should we give We'll give Zuelus a chance because I really want him to evolve. If he gets really hurt, then obviously we'll pull him back in before he faints, if we can, but... Oh, I got one of them. Contrary ability. Of course, it's contrary ability. I don't know, but I'm going to use Dragon Rush. Hopefully we actually hit. We do. Yes. <laughs> bye, bye. That should now make, ensure the level up. Yes. That's 1100, so that would have taken two for him to get that, and we've just done it in one, so that's good. That is good. Um, no, let's keep. Let's keep Zuelis out. Let's keep Zuelis out. I don't think Crunch is going to be all too effective against Obstagoon, but we can try. Voided. Okay. He used counter, but it failed. <laughs> you silly sausage. Shimmy <laughs> sausage. Take that voice. Here's a number I'd save just for this. You like the stands better chimmy on. It done nothing but enrage me. I do can. That really did not do a lot. Really didn't do a lot. Considering he's only level 46, I'm 65. That's almost 20 levels of difference. Uh, and 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 that move does a hundred power. That really did not do a lot at all. Oh, damn. Oh, stop using throw chop. <laughs> I don't like that blooming Polaroid image thing. Obstruct. What does that do? Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Again, we're using normal moves here. And as when we've used dark, fighting, fire, normal, dragon. You know where. We're trying to mix it up, up a little bit. And we're just going to show you can win with any any Pokemon. Any Pokemon you want. Um, I will actually put Corby out for a little bit. He's Corby. My bloody microphone. The headset that I bought for work. Um, it's like a gaming headset. 
obviously got this little mic um, like on the wire bit, like the button, so you turn the LED on. Uh, what is it? So you've got like this, that thing. So obviously you turn the volume up and down, the, turn, mute the mic and unmute it, turn the LED on and change the EQ. It's all wrapped up around my bloody switch controller wire. And kids, do, 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 do against my against my PC for some reason, so if you hear any in the audio, then that's what it is. Um, aftermath, I'm going to get hurt. Yep. <coughs> Skunk Town is down. I think that's Jim done. I believe. It is, yeah. Me and my team gave it our best. Let's meet up for a battle again sometime. Piers, I'd have no one else other than yourself by my side at Endgame, and here we go. Zuelis is evolving into a Hydragian, I believe, or Hydragius. Or Dry... Dragius. Hydragian. <laughs> Hydragian. Three-headed dragon now. <sighs> Obviously, Iron's Vi Dry. One, two, three. Yeah, boy! Brutal Pokemon. There are a slew of stories about villages that were destroyed by Hydrogen. In bites, anything that moves. Anything that moves. Okay. Okie dokie then. So that is probably where I'm going to call it, to be honest. And um, there is going to be a whole thing that happens now with a loud crash and a bang and a wallop and a thud and a... You know how it goes. Um, obviously, there is a bit where we're basically going to get taken from here out to Route 7. We're going to see Leon. He's going to talk about what the crash was. Um, he doesn't actually know what the crash was, but he goes to investigate. And um, that's pretty much it. So you not you don't really miss a lot anything in the story. Anything, any part of the story or any battle with Hop that has been cut out or not recorded is because it adds absolutely nothing to the story at all. <laughs> so... I was watching your battle, bro. It's how I learned to battle and all that. That right? That reminds me, man. There's something I wanted to tell you. I want you to take over the gym here in Spikemouth as its leader. Yeah, I know. You'd plan to retire after the cup, right? I think you've really become a great leader, and even if you don't Dynamax your Pokemon, I love you, but my answer is a big fat no. I mean, when I end up becoming champion, I, want to be a I won't be able to be a leader. Good point. In that case, let your big bro see if you have the skill to become a champion. Hey Strauss, thanks for having an amazing Pokemon battle with my brother. It's my turn next, so clear off for a bit, okay? Good thing. I'm gonna get slooped out of here anyway. Seriously, beat Piers. Hmm, here's a TM to remember it by Snarl. Snarl. Uh, yells as if it's ranting about something which lowers a special attack. There's the crash. Here's some random stranger. And, um,. Then we get dragged out. <laughs> Have a look around Spike with and see what it has to offer. Well, that's all it has to offer, really. Kaboom! Curse Bloosh! That's coming, I've got a handle on this, blah, 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 blah. Keep your eye on the goal. And for you, that's winning the challenge. The only badge left to get is the Dragon's Leader, Raihan. Raihan is the only trainer out there I consider a real rival. Um. Shouldn't be stopping for a chat. Here's the trouble with my name on it. Don't you worry about a thing. Unbeatable champion is here to keep you all safe. Kaboom. So yeah, that is where we're going to call it. Um, thank you so much for joining. Obviously, we've managed to... We actually managed to catch quite a few Pokemon today alongside... Um, alongside beating Spike with Jim. So that was really, really, really good. We actually caught nine Pokemon. Excuse me. We caught nine Pokemon. All in all. And obviously, well, we caught eight, but one of them was obviously Hydrogen, which has now evolved from Zuelis. But, so yeah, that is our current party. Our next stop is Raihan. And I believe I'm going to have a quick look at what he's got, got to offer. Um, 
Milo, Nessa, Cabu, Bay, Alistair, Opal, Gordy, Melanie, Raihan. Here we go. Raihan back in Hammerlock. Um, really, is that it? <laughs> Level 47, 46, 46, and 48. But obviously, he does double battles. So we'll probably go with Hydragen out. Hydragen up front. Alongside probably, probably Cinder or Tox. One of the two. Dependent. Um, Gyarados might also do a little bit. I'm not too sure because I think he's... So he's got Ground and Dragon, Dragon and Steel, Rock and Ground. So Gyarados might actually be a good shout here. But we're so overleveled. We're so overleveled. We could do Raihan next time, um, which I probably will do. But we'll do some raids and that beforehand. Um, get a load of XP candies. Um, chuck them all into the Pokemon, get them all beefed up even more because i think there's quite a lot that you get from them i could be wrong with that though um and hopefully you'll join us next time when we do that we do the raids we do raihan um and then after that we'll go and do winden and everything in there then at that point we'll say if you want to see any of the end game stuff not like the dlc but the actual end game stuff after defeating leon if you want to see that drop a comment and let me know i'll get that sorted and i'll make a note to record that before the dlc or if you want to jump straight on into the dlc in the crown tundra and isle of armor let me know again drop a comment but no like i said i'm going to call it a day because i'm waffling it's going to be strands out so take care stay safe stay awesome but most importantly have fun and if for whatever reason this sort of content is for you please let me know drop a comment drop a like smash that subscribe button it would mean the world to have you here really 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 would and hopefully i'll catch you next time all right guys see you in the next one bye